Hi, welcome back to my possible. So first and foremost, I would like to say that my channel is not for the weak, it's only for the real. So if you're sensitive, please go to another channel because Tasha don't really give a fuck about what she says or your feelings. Please like, subscribe, and share my videos as well. And next up, I'm doing Taurus Man, Pisces Man. <laughs> Taurus Man, Pisces Man. If they're both evolved, this can turn out to be a long-lasting relationship. Um, both of them are sensitive. Um, yeah, we're going to find this out in the long run. Um, but one of them is more, they're both introverted in a sense. Um, yeah, so let's get started. Okay, so upon meeting each other, you know, Taurus man, you know, he likes that Pisces man is more laid back like himself, more laid back in the cut, you know, somebody that he wants to, you know, figure out the mystery. They're both mysterious people and they're both going to find each other intriguing. Um, this can complicate things in the long run. Um, but yes, uh, so upon meeting each other, you know, great conversation. They're both business minded. You know, that's if the Pisces man is evolved because, he, you know, Pisces man is a hard worker, but then you find some that's a little bit too laid back and up in their head a lot and uh, can be very, very inconsistent. Okay, so does the Taurus man. If he feels um, some type of way or something's not going right in this type of connection, he could back off at any given moment. They both can do it to each other. Okay, but they're both sensitive. I don't know if that makes sense, but let's continue. So, <clears throat> yeah, so upon meeting each other, great conversation. What do you do? What do you do? Yes, have fun. Now, this is where things really get heated up. Pisces man is very free in the bedroom. What a slippery little fish he is. Yes, yes, yes. He's very freaky and nasty. Taurus man is going to like this side about him. Okay? And Pisces man uh, can be submissive. They both can be. So in the bedroom, like, you know, two minds meet in one. Very sensual, very passionate, but nasty and freaky at the same time. Like, just everything going on with these two motherfuckers. Okay? Yeah. Uh, another thing that Taurus man is going to like about Pisces man, he does know how to let, let loose and have fun. Okay? Yes. He does, all right? And Taurus man, you know, he's going to enjoy that about him because Taurus man, you know, he could be a little bit too laid back and in the cut, but Pisces man knows how to let loose, let, let loose uh, every now and then, okay? <clears throat> now, um, when it comes to emotional displays, both of them, neither one of them likes to really uh, speak about emotions. And one thing Pisces man could do is uh, Pisces man could say things just to disseminate the, the the issues at hand so for instance like with pisces man he could he could swim off at any given moment he could back off without giving notice taurus man is going to be left confused like hey i thought we was having a good time getting to know each other because these bo both of these men can be romantic but selfish in their own way okay yes all right um but it's just getting there with one another all right this is this is uh have to be a lot of patience a lot of understanding they're both patient okay they're both patient however taurus man when he says something he says it and he means it pisces man on the other hand he could say things just to not to argue they both don't like to argue but in this case you know communication effective communication has to be applied and honest communication because taurus man does it does doesn't want to hear uh i love you or you know this and that just to sort the issue no he wants to get down to the bottom of the nitty-gritty as, as to what is going on you know and then pisces man the more you push him the more he backs off so does the taurus man so either one of them could do it to each other because the taurus man feels like pisces man is playing mind games with him taurus man could back off at any given moment they both can be playing mind games with each other okay it started out so good but then Next thing you know, this is disappearing acts going on without notice, okay, from both sides, all right? And, uh, you know, one thing is for sure is Taurus man is a fixed sign, all right? So here we have earth meets water, okay? Now, who's going to ground this relationship is going to be the Taurus man. Why? Because Taurus man is uh, stable, security, he's an earth sign, so he looks for all of these things in the partner. And also, he looks for consistency, Consistency, although he can be inconsistent at times. Here's where the confusion lies. Okay? Um, so, you know, with the Pisces man, he can be very inconsistent up and down, here and there, everywhere, because he's a fish. He goes all over the place. Uh, 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 uh. Okay? And Taurus man is going to be very skeptical about this type of behavior. Okay? Because Taurus man, when he's in it, he's in it for the long haul. But if he has any suspicion 
of you know any because he's very intuitive he goes by how he feels so if he have they both are so if they he has any uh intuition of pisces man stepping out because pisces man he can be here there everywhere and so there's the taurus man they could do it to each other but if they both evolve this can turn out to be a long-lasting relationship where they really understand each other because words are effective so here's the thing when taurus man comes straight and direct to the pisces man pisces man can back off and not want to uh speak at that given moment <clears throat> which is going to irritate the fuck out of the taurus man okay so this right here, you know, um, Pisces man needs to speak up right away when need be, okay? And then when Pisces man is ready to speak up, Taurus man is not ready to hear him because when I was trying to speak to you and get down to the bottom of what's really going on, you, you didn't want to speak, okay? So they could both be selfish in this department when it comes to displaying, you know, speaking effectively, more so the Pisces man, okay? Another thing is... Um, Taurus man is not going to like Pisces man selfish and self-indulgent ways at times, okay? All right? So Taurus man, yes, he could be frugal, cheap and frugal, but Pisces man could be just straight up cheap and with hope, okay? Now, uh, they both are romantic. They both, you know, but if they, uh, if this turns out to be a long-lasting relationship, these two uh, could really hit it off well. Yes, they can. Because they're both business minded and you know, they both uh, can balance each other out and bring out the best in each other if it fucking gets there. Because this kind of relationship could be uh, a roller coaster ride with these two motherfuckers, okay? Yes, yes, it can be. Um, closing up and you know, mystery and you know, not wanting to speak effectively at times and you know, because Taurus man, he could do it to the Pisces man. He could say one thing and then back off at any given moment without notice. Or just stop, you know, they could do it to each other, okay? And then Pisces man is going to be, like, wondering, like, what's going on now? The whole thing about them is that they're both patient, okay? And with effective communication, they will allow each other their, that time and space, need be, that they need, okay? Um, but one thing is for sure that they're both sensitive. Words do affect them, okay? All right, words and action. So, Taurus, they're both action-oriented people basically that so this is like a mirror relationship but they have a lot to teach each other each other and can really balance each other out now the bedroom is not going to be a problem it's just the effective communication and the mind games that they think each other is playing with each other okay living together both are going to take on um responsibilities okay in this department more so the taurus man than the pisces man so uh communication about finances has to be um spoken about but this could turn out to be a very very sweet connection between these two very sweet very sensual very loving very romantic once they get there this can turn out to be a long-lasting relationship because they're both long-term people once they once they get there once once in it they're long-term kind of people and this could last the test of time okay as long as Pisces man doesn't tell Taurus man what he wants to hear but speaking effectively and honestly and openly with him okay because that's what he looks for he looks for straight direct straight up just tell me straight up okay because he's gonna be straight up with the pisces man but pisces man doesn't know how to handle that type of talk all right uh you know taurus man they both could be a little bit promiscuous but more so the pisces man than the taurus man <laughs> and this is where taurus man is going to be skeptical and looking at pisces side eye okay like hey you know what are you doing a lot of spying going on between uh, you know, with the Taurus and, you know, shit like that. And yeah. Okay. Because they're both a mystery. They're both a mystery trying to solve each other. But at any given moment, they could back off from each other and leave each other up in their heads. Like what the fuck just happened? I thought we had a good thing going on. Okay. But yes, if you could learn how to get past these obstacles, uh, a lot of endurance has to be applied. Patience is no problem. You both have patience, but one more effective communicating than the other yeah so taurus man is going to be the one to bust pisces man out of that fantasy world and bring him back down to earth because taurus man likes to get down to the nitty gritty he's not afraid to speak how he feel and what's on his mind pisces man more so he's very very cautious and he takes a long time to open up when it comes to speaking effectively at the given moment and just say anything just just to you know go away with the problem but 
Taurus man doesn't want to hear anything. He wants to hear the honest truth. And this is that's why I said honest communication needs to be displayed here. Um, yeah. But a lot of fucking between these two. All right? Sexual, highly sexual, intense uh, connection here. Okay? Anyway, I have to go. And they could really balance each other out because Pisces man knows how to bring out the fun side in the Taurus man. Because Pisces man does have a fun side. Okay? So, yeah. I, but part two coming. I, I could go on and on and on. But part two is coming soon. I love you guys. I'm possible. You're possible. Thumbs up. Subscribe. Share. I'm out.